everyone, welcome to today's day trading recap for Monday, July 12th. Starting off the week on a positive note, plus $770 today. Uh, let's start with the Mighty 90s. Did just one in DKNG, basically a scratch, plus $63. And then no pairs trades on the runners. Uh, small scratch loss, minus 15 in Roku. Facebook, plus 410. Roblox, minus 178. And Piton, plus 60. And NVIDIA, plus 430. So... No real monster winners, uh, just some doubles and singles, which is just fine with me. Uh, kept my position size fairly small uh, again today uh, and just uh, taking profits as they come. So uh, first Mighty 90 here, DKNG had this initial flush in the morning, got a nice little volume pop, got long right in here, started to bounce and then rolled over and then finally popped up and just got out of it there for a uh, $63 winner, basically a scratch. On to Roku and the Runners. Sounds like the name of a band. Roku and the Runners. Uh, so Roku uh, started off weak, and but the market started getting strong. And so when, when Roku pushed up here into positive territory and pulled back right here, I got long looking for a bounce. Didn't happen. It broke down and just kind of started chopping around. So I cut out of that for a small loss. And then it pushed back up again and pulled back. So I got in again right here looking for a continuation. Uh, traded down a little bit and then finally popped up. And so I, I got a little bit of a profit on that one. So net net minus 15 bucks on those two Roku trades, Facebook plus 410. So Facebook, uh, was just kind of chopping around, but it kept bouncing. Uh, well, it, it initially started weak, went into negative territory, bounced all the way back up to highs of day. And when it pulled back to yesterday's high, I got in right here, kind of chopped around for a while and then finally pushed up and took off. And I booked 410 on that one. I think I got out of my last piece uh, around here or here. I can't remember which one, but somewhere in there. So nice trade in Facebook. Roblox, uh, a couple different pieces to this one. Uh, my initial trade was a winner. Uh, started getting this massive volume. Jumped in here. This thing ripped up and, um, and got out for nice profit. And then when it pulled back, I got in again looking for more. And that one just kind of fell apart. So net net, I took a loss on a Roblox of minus 178. And this thing was it looked so strong. It was up almost 5% at one point and then came all the way back down into negative territory. So big, uh, big swings in Roblox. Uh, Piton was uh, plus 60. So Piton, let's see what I did here. Oh, so Piton had a big uh, volume spike here. Oops, that's not Piton. Let me get Piton up on the board. There we go. Thought that didn't think that looked right. Yeah, here we go. So Piton uh, was flushing, had a big volume spike here. So when it bounced, got short, took a little off here, bounced up again, came back down, took a little off here. I was waiting for it to break through, but it just kept bouncing. And so I didn't want to overstay my, my welcome. And so when it started to pop up, got out of my last piece and ended up booking a $60 profit, which was a good exit because this thing just ripped up on me. Uh, so good exit for a small winner. And then lastly, NVIDIA. So let's go to NVIDIA. NVIDIA, just below its, its all-time high, so I was looking for it to kind of break out. It never did, but I was still able to book 430 uh, on NVIDIA. Um, when it, so when it pulled, when it had this push up, up towards the highs and then pulled back to the base of this price level here, this is where I got long, caught some of that. Um, and then when it pulled back, let's see, I got in again. I think it was on this pullback here. Yeah, right around here, I got long again, took some heat. I tried to add down here, didn't get filled, uh, bounced, kind of chopped around for a while and finally pushed up and ended up booking a nice profit, 430 overall. So those are all the trades, uh, plus 770 to start the week. I'll take it. Look forward to seeing everybody in the live stream room tomorrow. We're streaming every day this week, so look forward to seeing you then.